thank you for inviting me here today to speak about building better connections with the people we lead. Have any of you ever had the joy, the joy of online dating? I have a lot. And let me share one of my many, many experiences. It was a Sunday in July and I was going to meet my prospective date for coffee. According to his profile, he was tall, dark and handsome, well-educated, a successful attorney, Midwest values, and an athlete. I'm like, yes, finally, my man is coming. Thank you, God. So that morning, I put on my cute little sundress, spent a little more attention on my hair, and eagerly, eagerly drove to the coffee shop. I get to the coffee shop, I'm looking around. Nobody is looking like the man of my dreams. I'm like, hmm. So I, I wave my, Steve, Steve, is there a Steve? Finally, a gentleman stands up. He is 30 pounds heavier, four inches shorter, and seven years older. I'm thrilled. I'm like, here we go. So I sit down, I make polite conversation with him. Finally, after five minutes, I reach over, gingerly, I grab his hand. I look at him in the eyes and I said, Steve, you and I both know that this isn't gonna work. You don't look like anything like your picture. And he looks back at me and goes, what? Well, you don't either, he bursts. I go, well, no, I don't. I look better. And, he, and I got up and left. Now granted, Steve did not look like his profile. Had he looked more like his profile, probably a li higher likelihood that we would have had some kind of a connection and we had, would have had a potential date because there would have possibly been chemistry. But the, at the end of the day, I still would need to meet that person in person, have that human energy exchange and feel that chemistry, right? I find it hilarious. People use online dating a two-dimensional application to determine a three-dimensional attraction. The same thing we're doing when we use our phones. We text, we email, we Zoom, thinking we're having these meaningful connections with people and we're not. We're having our digital technology replace our cameras, our alarm, alarm clocks, and our calendars. Don't let them replace your relationships. I'm Kimberly Lane with the Kimberly Connection Company and I believe connections change everything.